what's the end goal? Do we need to continue striving towards these higher and higher definition maps? What's the value of that? Yeah, so first, right, we talk about the industries changing. One thing that's big in the industry is changing is this open mapping now. Everyone collaborating on a base map. The next big industry change is really us being able to change how we think about mapping because for the longest time, we we're mapping for humans to navigate the world. So how does a human get through and navigate the world? And then you could navigate them, say, to a building and then they can self-navigate to the door. Or if there's a problem with the, the map, they can self-navigate through it. Now we're building maps for computers to understand their place in the world and navigate through the world. And computers are not nearly as sophisticated as humans. Um, and so we need to add s s such a more significant amount of detail information into the map to really help uh, the computer navigate. And in autonomous driving, where it gets super interesting is, so I tell people, what, why is a map important? Well, would you want to sit in a taxi cab with a person who's driving for the first time from the airport to the downtown center, or would you want to sit in a taxi cab that's been doing it for years, thousands of times? The map embeds, we have thousands of trips every single day between the airport and the city center, and we can embed all that behavioral information so that the car can operate like a human.